to America's Got Talent Reaction Time! It is back! <laughs> and this time, it's all the best, the Champions Edition! Yes. It is starting, and they've already released the first act. They call it an early release. Early, yes, early, because I thought we're just gonna film later mm, tonight. Yeah, this, this came out like a couple days ago. Duo Transcend as a way to kind of tease people for the new season. That we never actually checked out this duo before. They're a high flying acrobatic act of some sort from season 13. Mm -hmm. And let's just get into it. Let's, I'm sure they got a little bit of an intro, but I'm sure it's gonna be dramatic and I'm sure it's gonna be sexy mm -hmm. with blindfolds. <laughs> Why is it always sexy when women's being blindfolded? Oh, it's sexier when the guy's being blindfolded. Oh. If the woman don't look good. What the <laughs> <laughs> all right, y'all. Let's check this out, y'all. Let's, let's do, do it. All it. right. And away we go. Oh, I like these guys. I love them. I oh, love me too. too. Oh, I love you. Tell me your names. I'm Mary. This that is my dude husband, is Tice. Hercules. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> Are you guys gonna do anything different for us tonight? Yeah, we are. Yes. We're actually, we're doing something that we've never done in front of anyone before. So Excellent. You guys are the first to see this. <laughs> no. I did see the clip of you guys and I saw that you had something wrong with your eye. Sounds dangerous. Yeah. And sexy. That dude though, seriously, oh my God. How is that now? Um, so yeah, I, I have a, an eye disease called keratoconus and because of AGT, we had one of the most successful eye surgeons in the country reach out to us personally and Aww. he was able to do a procedure where he stopped the progression of the disease so i no longer oh. will go what? completely blind wow that's awesome we need to go and make that talent too because i got a couple of surgeries and things i need to work on what do you on. need <laughs> hair 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 transplants when we first auditioned at America's Got Talent, it wasn't a question of if I would go blind, but just a question of when. Now, there's this future that looks completely different, and I would have never known if it wasn't for coming on AGT. I think this is the first act of its kind I could see going into the finals of America's Got Talent. Thank you. But during the judge cuts, we had a really bad fall. What? Oh, you know what? I think I did see this before. What? He dropped her, actually. No way. Oh. It was terror on the trapeze last night. We witnessed the most frightening accident in the show's history. Ah! 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 It felt like that was the end. So when they put us through, we knew that we had to push ourselves farther and farther every round. Right. So that's what they want? I think they want you to take it down a notch. That sounds oh like God. going more dangerous is the wrong direction. Incredible. It was sensational. It was the final 10 acts left, and it gave us kind of a boost that, like, maybe we could win the whole thing. That experience oh was so <laughs> traumatic for us, but we didn't let it stop us. After AGT, life's been better than we hoped for. We've been able to perform for crowds of 20,000 people around the country. That dude is just straight up. He looks like a WWE wrestler. His Aww. physique, huh? And the best part is that little Jax gets to come along with us. Our son Jax is everything to us. And now we're able to give him the life that we want to give and him. And her, look at her body. Yeah, actually, she, she oh looks like a God. WWE wrestler. Successful. Still to this day, we wished we had won. Okay, Jack, here we go. Why we're here for champions we want to show our son that even if you fall you can get back up and make it to the top he really looks like he man that's not easy to do either right he's not like lean and muscular he's thick so that means like he has to carry his weight mm. as well i think it'd be a lot easier if he was like yeah. lean and muscular i'm nervous It looked like Simon's on fire too there. But <laughs> the whole stage presence, man, is freaking amazing. This is 
Oh my god, they're really, really high up there. Do they do they even have a net or a nothing? A mattress? This Anything? mattress. This mattress. Peanuts the down there, something? Both of them this time, so the last time was just the uh, male. So he's saying he's done this before. He must have practiced this. It's just he's never done it publicly. Yeah, me too. <laughs> oh my God, your hands are sweaty, baby. How do you get so sweaty in two minutes? Very traumatic because of the slow I, they motion. Slow -mo though. It. Yeah, when they slow mo it, it's a little unfair. But still, oh my god. How could the judges see anything Ooh. with all that smoke coming in? Oh my god. <laughs> That was so intense. That was pretty intense. You don't want to touch my armpit right now. <laughs> you did touch my palm, but you know what? <laughs> 10 years already. Oh I know which parts of your body are sweaty. Oh. Have I ever tried oh to reach under there just to test it out? <laughs> Is that something you expect me to do? Like oh, I do it gross. often or something? Okay, that's TMI, but oh Lord. Even the background story that gives a lot of intensity to their performance this time, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. God. Oh, AGT definitely picked the right early release, if you will. <laughs> I guess you could call it that. Right, because they have an interesting story, right? Husband and wife mm -hmm. got to the finals, didn't win. Husband going blind. Husband drops wife. Wife leaves husband <laughs> for younger man. <laughs> Just drama, baby. Wow. Drama. Really, what a great comeback. Mm. That That is what you call comeback. But the thing is with this type of act is, where do you go from here? Because the last time they did this, they got to the finals. And it looks like they lost to Shim Lim, which I would understand. That dude was Phenoma, the magician who's... Right. Pretty much I think everyone in the world now knows and I feel like they've done their most amazing act. So this time they took it even one step further. Both are blindfolded, right? Mm -hmm. And he used one hand. What's what he's gonna do next? Catch her with his teeth? I don't know. Two fingers? Tun tun? Like that? Like you, with fire. This is all over their body. Or spikes below. Or piranhas. A giant no. kiddie pool, a piranha no. fish. No. <laughs> I, I mean, exactly my point. Like, yeah, I just don't know how you would take this any further. This is as good as it gets. This is it. This is first audition. Mind you, right? The champions, which means that you have to already be a step up mm -hmm. above what you've done before. And mm -hmm. so unlike, say, singing acts, which you see just a different song, these daredevil types of acts are... Mm, it's going to be crazy. Well, who knows? They can do crazier than that. Yeah, I already gave you a couple. Yes, they can do it on did. top of blades and piranhas. <laughs> you did. So or they can cover wait. themselves it's... in peanut butter so it makes it extra hard to grasp. Or maybe the ropes are on fire. My point is it's the same type of act at this point. Anything more extreme is a variant of that. So I feel like if they want to do something interesting, they need to perhaps do different types of acts, I think. That's just my, you know, suggestion at this point. Peanut butter and piranhas. I mean, you don't want me as a coach. Jeez. 
My gosh, <laughs> John, your your mind is just. No, I just think a lot about these kind of acts, these danger acts of like, where do you take it? And the inevitability is, I don't think a danger act has ever gone all the way to the finals because as you keep ratcheting it up, there's a point where you can't take it any further. That's it, right? Like, and you don't want to take it any further. It just gets uncomfortable to watch because it's so dangerous. This was already like, like you're saying, mm -hmm, sweaty, <laughs> it, right? It's, it's enough. I, I'm very happy with what they've done. I'm just saying. <laughs> they deserve a show here in Las Vegas. That's that's true. If they're not, they may already be here. They might. They may already yes. be here. Peanut ah. butters and piranha, I'm telling you.